All right, let's just get up the biggest hill of this route. I'm about to fly down. I get well over 30 mile an hour down here. You can come and join me on it. I have absolutely overdressed that snood thing on thermal hat, thermal jacket, and thermal trousers, and my winter boots. You know what? It's bloody warm out here. Does actually feel like summer is coming. I might have broken the bad weather. Get in, cycling season officially started. Summer's here. Woo! So when I did my last uh, big ride, the 100k, and I said I was struggling, it actually turns out that I had COVID. So pretty well to get around, to be fair. No wonder I was struggling the last 20k on that one. But yeah, I'm back out again now, and I'm feeling a bit sluggish, but I'm recovering. Just need to uh, get back into my rhythm, shake off this COVID, and then crack on with it. But uh, it's about eight days ago now. And I'm still still pretty tired, but you know, we'll get there, see how we get on. But we're gonna push it, get back to my levels that I was on before. I'm gonna bike back from its service. Shout out to Halfords in Aberystwyth. 40 quid, new brake cable, sort of my disc pads out. Happy days. Let's go up a massive, massive hill. On top of it is a uh, dam. Uh, so yeah, see how we got on. Need to get my legs training for these hills. I hate hills, but we've got to do it. Chase the train, let's go. Nice. The big one, six and a half kilometer hill climb. Woo, let's go. You know you're high up when the trees are massive. Woo, big hill. Halfway up and I ain't stopped. Well happy with myself. Just got to the top of a six and a half kilometer climb. Did stop once, absolutely buzzing. Not a massive amount up here yet. I've got another one coming in two kilometres, so I think I'm going even higher, which would probably suggest the hills in the distance down there. Ouch. I'm absolutely in the middle of nowhere, but I can see the hill coming up. A couple of big reds and oranges on this. Oh, legs are still cooked from the last one. Help me. Help me. Halfway up the second climb, I'm going to stop because this is pretty epic up here. I start to get to the sort of reservoir areas. So that water over there in the background, that's the bottom end of it. I'm basically going to follow it up the hill till I get to the top where the dam is. Wish me luck. Final bit of the climb left. I am pretty high. But you can just see in the distance over there, there's like a big kicker. That is me, and then I'm at the top. You see the dam just over the other side of the hill? I'm nearly there. Whoa, this is tough going. There it is, made it. Whoa. That was actually a false plateau. Oh, still about another 200 meters to go. That was rough. 
I'm done now though, on my way back down towards the dam. Yes. Wow, look at that. That is seriously impressive. Hard work getting up here, but a couple of minutes on this bridge is nice. Happy days. Absolutely epic up here. Love it. I think this is the last of the sort of basin bit. There you go. I got a hill to get up and then a descent back down to Talibont, which then takes me up another hill and back to the caravan. So I'm kind of getting to sort of be where I know where I am now, but this has been absolutely stunning. I will definitely be doing this again. I think I've seen one car the whole way around, which was parked up on the side of the road. So no stress or pressure or anything. Absolutely epic. And the hills up here are testing my legs. So, getting what I need to out of it, which is good. Final push to home now. Literally three bends and a hill. Oh, I'm done though. Absolutely exhausted, that has killed me. Even the sprints nowadays come with hills. Everything is hill orientated. I hate it, but I gotta start to love it. Yeah. What goes up must it's Saturday night, uh, just having a quick 20k because we've got a massive sportive tomorrow. So that's from Shrewsbury Town Football Club. It goes up towards Church Stretton and Pulverbatch and uh, just miles, huge hills, all the all the big hills. Uh, ends up in Stiper Stones as well before it comes back down. So just gonna keep the legs fresh. Uh, good test for my legs. Uh, you know, the hills are coming up in France. So this is kind of baby France for a day. See how I get on. Last time I did a sport T for Shrewsbury, ended up pushing up a few hills, but test was tight as hell. Uh, COVID, which I didn't really know about when I started the ride. Uh, so yeah, hopefully we'll have a better outing tomorrow. And fingers crossed, no pushing. That's it. Final ride done before my sport teeth tomorrow. Check in, see how I'm getting on. Be probably on a fresh video. This will probably be the end of the first one. And we'll start the next one ready for that. Nice place to start with, see how the legs are, see how the lungs are, see if I'm getting ready for France or not.